So I'm going to come in here and I've got my paintbrush. Notice that I have black and white in my mask. The white part is what is selected and the black part is what is unselected. In other words, we can't see everything that's black. So if I want to add to the selection, I will be painting with white. So I'll do my little switch here. Now I have white selected and when I paint, it will add to the selection. Obviously I don't want to add that much to the selection. So I'm going to come in here and add a little bit of time, a little bit at a time. Uh, my brush is very soft right now so I'm going to right click or if you have a Mac you can control click and get this same thing. My hardness is really low so I'm going to turn it up to somewhere around 70% and try to pull some of that back in. It's a little bit difficult to see what you are trying to add so if you want to you can add your background layer back on. Click on that background layer, double click it so that you can have a rasterized layer and turn your opacity down around looks like 60 or 70 looks good and if I zoom in there I should be able to see where the edge of that foot is a little bit easier ah <laughs> except that you have an issue when you're not on the right layer so let's try this again there we go now when I paint with white it should add into my selection again. And you can see that it's working because the areas that I'm painting are becoming darker. So I'll just go around the rest of my picture and make sure that I have the correct parts in my selection. Now I want to get rid of a part of my selection. So I'm going to want to have black because the black is what's covered. So I'm going to switch from white to black and I can just select X to do that. 